So the encoding and decoding is going to be a game changer and revolutionary for video editors, especially the 1590, because the 1590 has the most media engines inside their GPU. It has three encoders and two decoders. If we move down to 4080, then there's two on 4080 and 4070 Ti, and then the 4070 will have one of each. So if you want the best video editing performance and exporting performance, the 5090 is the best what you can get. Now we're going to be looking at Premiere Pro, but very importantly, the Premiere Pro version that I'm able to test doesn't actually support the whole media engines and the shebang of the 5090. So it kind of just uses it as kind of an upgraded 4090 and can't utilize all of the features of the 5090. So we're going to have to make an update on that later on, but I'm expecting it to be a lot faster than what I'm seeing right now. But right now we're just seeing it as it is. The 4090 is roughly about 16% faster than the 3090, which was quite a big jump. The 7900 XDX is about 1 to 5% faster than the 3090, depending what you're doing.